ஹலோ வெரி குட் மார்னிங் ஐ எம் சி அரவிந்த் ஃப்ரம் ராஜலக்ஷ்மி இன்ஜினியரிங் காலேஜ் ஹீலிங் ஃப்ரம் தி டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் ஆஃப் மெக்கானிக்கல் இன்ஜினியரிங் அண்ட் தி கோர்ஸ் தட் ஐ ஹவ் அண்டர் டுக் ஓவர் திஸ் பீரியட் ஆஃப் டுவெல் வீக்ஸ் இஸ் ரேப்பிட் ப்ரோட்டோ டைப்பிங் விச் இஸ் எக்ஸ்ட்ரீம்லி அண்ட் சூப்பர்லி தாட் பை தி ப்ரொஃபஸர்ஸ் ஆஃப் ஐஐடிஸ் A noteworthy point is that in PTL courses uh, facilitate and uh, extend the knowledge boundaries of any typical student who is studying in any entire colleges. And the second noteworthy point that, uh, that this particular NPTEL course offered is the extensive lab session demonstration offered by the corresponding IITs. thirdly i would like i would also like to make uh, this point very clear that is the submission of assignments and the facilitation and the doubt clarification sessions that is constantly being held in forums and the third noteworthy point is the conductance of live sessions by iits who are doing an extremely good job in clearing and clarif- and clarifying the doubts of the students and uh, finally i would also like to congratulate the testing facilities that were available during the course of the time and uh, since this period is being a traumatic period uh, for the citizens of india especially south that is in chennai the test centers have taken extreme measures to ensure the smooth facilitation and the smooth transition of the exam from starting to beginning and uh, hoping that the many students take up this nptel uh, courses as uh, they provide and they cater and they mold the students into greater heights and uh, thus also enabling the second important factor for any non iitn that is if you perform the course well you might get a chance to work with the corresponding iit professors who are professors who are working in the department that you have a strong hold on thank you i am jayshree working as a associate professor in srm institute of science and technology katangulathur uh, uh, during the academic year uh, 2020 2021 i have done uh, um, uh, digital circuit the concept explained is uh, very a uh, good uh, with a uh, uh, good understanding we were able to uh, study the subject and the uh, weekly assignments uh, we were uh, able to do with the help of that uh, um, we were uh, continuously putting up our effort in uh, learning the subject and uh, uh, the final exam uh, also the questions were easy and we were able to complete the exam within the time uh, thank you so, uh, so much for all the effort you have taken for our benefit and all the uh, faculties working in a different institute will be benefited a lot through that many of our students will get the benefit and they will learn the course with the good and proper understanding Th- thank you for all the effort put by the neptal uh, course uh, uh, corporate uh, 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 members and all the um, team uh, people working in that uh, we really thank you uh, from our uh, heart thank thanks a lot thank you hi my name is divya i work as assistant professor at nif chennai Uh, I came to write Understanding Ethnography, which was a really superb course by Professor Dr. Nina Sabnani. Uh, the exam was pretty simple, it was actually slightly vague, but uh, I was able to complete it in half an hour. I won't say it was very easy in the sense that all the questions, because they are multiple choice questions, it's the case of wording. So even one, one word changes, the meaning changes. So uh, in that case, some of them were a little hard. but uh, it was okay it was doable but it's a very useful course thank you my name is harit raguram and i have taken the nptel examination my subject is organizational behavior it has been a 12 week program and it has been a very productive program for me and i have learned a lot because i look to develop in my personality soft skills as well as organizational behavior 
and stuff like that and doing this exam will be opening my mind and also helping other people around me after this examination and help and guide people with this qualification i get thank you uh the course which i have applied for is uh, industrial safety engineering related to occupational health and safety i am working uh, in the same relevant field i am uh, hse engineer at uh, saipam india projects limited i am working at the corporate with the corporate hse team and this course is uh, this certification could uh, help with my career growth so it is relevant to my field of work uh, so it is very uh, very useful <laughs> but my feedback with relevant to this examination this final examination is that the course materials the course uh, delivered everything was perfect uh, the assignments were uh, challenging yes all that was perfect but for the exam final examination part i think the duration is absurdly high i even in the same venue like two weeks back i attempted nlc examination that was like uh the duration was like uh, a minute for a question like 120 questions 120 minutes that's it but here it was like 50 questions and the duration is 3 hours which is absurdly high i would say an hour or an hour and a half where yeah of, of course we were allowed to leave after an hour and a half but that would be the optimal duration for the co- for this examination that's what my feedback would be so apart from that everything else is perfect so yeah thank you very much my name is mukesh so i am from uh, tamil nadu tambetkal law university glc pkm so i am a law student i did constitutional studies so the examination was easy i just watched all the videos and submitted my assignments regularly i passed uh, 17.5% out of 25 marks uh, in assignments and uh, the videos were very, very helpful and it's almost Uh, if you watch the videos and submit the assignments that would be very enough and sufficient for uh, uh, doing very well in the examination so it was very easy assignments were uh, easy like it depends it depends few concepts uh, you 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 need intense understanding and few it is enough if you have watched the videos properly uh, actually i had enrolled three courses so then only i uh, uh, decided of what the course i'll have to uh, attend physically so first two assignments i didn't submit but other assignments i, I, I was submit because at the time i didn't uh, expect that the, the, i'll take this uh, one for the physical appearance can you please repeat what is the examination uh, the i thought that it, uh, uh, it, it would be li- little difficult but it was easier uh, than my expectations no uh, of, of, of course i'm just a second year student and just now i complete uh, complete my first year so i now i don't uh, uh, much think about what i'll do in my future but uh, i i like i'm thinking like i have to write more such examinations um, preferably in, uh, now i'm doing law and next uh, next time i'll do any courses from management such as taxation direct taxes so now i understood something right thank you, thank you. so my name is arihant uh so i'm writing this exam like for my uh, for my second year actually um so i think it's, it's actually kind of easy if you're following the assignments and you're just reading the transcripts so it's actually kind of easy but then it seems hard when it's uh, a typing exam so that's one thing but then it's actually easy if you're just don't watch the videos a lot but then watch it if you're so in doubt so yeah it's kind of easy just do your best that's all all So the assignments actually depends on the subject. Uh usually it's actually easy if you are just following the transcripts. So I've done like uh, two courses so far. I've completed that in my last year and uh for like this is my second course I'm writing. So yesterday also I wrote an exam. Yeah, most of the time is useful because sometimes the questions we answer or like it changes actually. Uh the right answer is different and the answer they have given us also different. So sometimes using it is very effective. Yeah thank you. Uh, Sivaraj Kumar Energy Conservation and Waste Creator Recovery. So it was good actually and uh, I'm uh, doing this exam after 15 years of my you no know, study uh, uh, I'm working presently and uh, it is a uh, no, good experience so that I can uh, you no know, re- no, refresh my fundamentals. It is no uh, giving uh, confident on the you no know, research and calculation of my area where uh, no I'm working. 
and uh, oh, it's like uh, no going uh, going through again on my basics it's actually a basic course but i wanted to do uh, for my career development oh it was very good examination actually i have not expected like that this is my first uh, experience and the exam also easy and i have not much prepared well but if i prepared uh, and if i spent more time on the course and uh, no uh, if i come for the exam then uh, My name is Vidya Sagar R. I'm from DG Vaishnav Varumbakam. Gender and literature. Initially my professor told me to take uh, some interesting uh, course. Then uh, he came out with a uh, gender and literature and uh, I found uh, something interesting in the title. So in our society itself we have uh, so many gender issues and uh, in our education system itself we have so many contradictions and uh, people are biased so i found uh, something interesting in the title itself i i just decided to pick this course that's what the reason good afternoon uh, i am tamil arsi from uh, working as assistant professor in rajalakshmi engineering college uh, now i am doing digital circuits uh, in this uh, uh course uh, i did all my assignments well and all videos uh, my uh, uh, corresponding uh, coordinator taught as well okay it's very useful for us and i also played a role of mentor for this course um it's very useful for my career and also develop my knowledge thank you i am dr b meena i am working at petition college as head department of commerce and as well as vice principal now today i took management accounts yesterday i took cost accounts no i need to develop my knowledge uh, as well as i need to monitor my students they are also coming for writing examination as a mentor simultaneously i look into the assignments as well as i can guide them how to getting pass in nptel examination it will be very useful for them in the accounts knowledge they can develop they can work in future in all mnc's companies it's a part of curriculum for our uh, course so it simultaneously it's useful to update the knowledge i'm srinivasan i'm a assistant professor i'm working as in madras veterinary college in department of veterinary pharmacology and toxicology i've taken uh, drug delivery and uh, uh, principles and engineering this is uh, something which i have a very limited knowledge though i work in uh, pharmacology but our area is totally of uh, you know treatment aspect but formulation aspect i don't have much knowledge so i had taken this course it was very useful yeah npdl is really doing very good and i'm um, very happy about it like lot of courses are you know uh, which i thought could have done during my uh, college work i missed it i didn't do but i got a chance now to do it that's way it's really useful for me to upgrade my knowledge and uh, it is more on engineering and uh, uh, bi- biological side is a bit lesser but i would suggest that uh, more on bi- biological side should come up and especially in the icr like agricultural and veterinary side also there is nothing like there is no course on i believe there is no course on agriculture and veterinary so that if that can be brought into that then this will be useful for that sector you are more concentrating on engineering sector but uh, agriculture and veterinary also can be included thank you so much i'm sinduja actually i'm a faculty i have done my physiotherapy so masters in physiotherapy i have taken neuroscience of uh, human movement like uh, i expected uh, my uh, i i have uh, done physiotherapy so i have t- chosen a course which is related to me neuroscience of human movement so i i was expecting the same related to neuro and uh, movements related so what i expected they exceeded the limit yeah it was uh, really uh, very nice uh, they have given so much of informations details about each and every uh, like brain and spinal cord each and every part they have given detailed uh, informations it was very useful for me so that i can also teach my students um, all the things no they are doing well so i can suggest to my students also <laughs> first thing uh, to do the courses and uh, the exam is also really uh, easy to do thank you
என் பேர் சுவாமிநாதன் மா நாங்கள் குரோம்பேட் சென்னையில் தான் வராங்க சோலார் இன்ஜினியரிங் அண்ட் டெக்னாலஜி கொஞ்சம் அசைன்மெண்ட்ஸ்லாம் கொஞ்சம் சொல்யூஷன்லாம் கொடுத்தா நல்லாயிருக்கும் அந்தளவுக்கு கொடுக்கல அது கொஞ்சம் கஷ்டமாக தான் இருந்தது இந்த சொல்யூஷன்லாம் கொடுத்தா இன்னும் நல்லாயிருக்கும் ஸ்ரீதர் ஐ எம் அ ஒர்க்கிங் ப்ரொஃபஷனல் இன்ட்ரடக்ஷன் டு ஜாப்பனீஸ் லாங்குவேஜ் அண்ட் கல்ச்சர் Uh, I am uh, passionate about learning a foreign language so I have taken this Japanese course. Yeah the course was good the assignments uh, given in the NPTEL website was also good. It was easy to read and then uh, I was able to take the exam confidently. Veeresh IIT Madras Waves and Oscillation a physics course. Uh online courses are uh, very comfortable you can watch it again there are a lot of ways to uh this there are many benefits one thing is online this is online lecture and where you cannot directly contact the professor but mails mentors you know other students will be having the we we are having the forum like we can ask the doubts I mean, but little like uh, in one or two days we'll get the reply a solution whatever we want we can ask but only thing is like we cannot directly one to one we cannot talk in in, in real no no not the class and all so but compared to that there are many advantages so considering the advantages you don't think uh, disadvantages are like you cannot uh, say that uh, because of this i know i'm not taking the course if you want it if you want to learn something then npt is the best option people have a different mind they want to come to iit and they want to study in iit or ias or, or iisc but that is not how it is people who want to learn they can learn anywhere the npt is a you know the same professors from iits they teach and the content is also same and the ts are also like students of iit so they, there is nothing difference from i i am a iit student so i know it but people don't know it people who know it they are you know taking advantage of it and they are utilizing the resources i think we have to be very practical what is what is the content that we have to look at the content not the brand or the not the college not the name of the college or like it's a, it's a completely different thing that's how it is i'm kavya and uh, i just took my nptel exam for gender and literature this was uh, a very useful course for me uh, i'm a student of literature so to learn about how gender acts out in texts of literature as well as our social life in connection to the so- uh, society today the culture and how uh everything from colonialism to something as simple as advertisements affect gender and normalize and change the notion of gender was a very interesting topic to learn and the nptel platform was very easy to access the exam was uh pretty well uh it was good yeah it was as expected it wasn't extremely hard but a few of the questions were thought provoking Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm Meenakka from HVC. Actually, I found the NPTEL courses interesting. Uh, for the last four years, I'm attending different courses and all the assignments and course was very interesting. And exams also, we are finding it uh, different from whatever we are attempting. Thank you. I'm Shankar. I'm uh, from Chennai only. I'm doing my, uh, I've done my master's already. I'm working right now in industry and uh, I did, I registered for reinforced concrete bridges. The assignments were good. It was, uh, it was this. Uh, this one was more concentrated on superstructure design. Its assignments were periodic. I submitted uh, assignments periodically, and most of the questions that came today was from the assignments only. And it was challenging. The numerical problems were good. Uh, really, it was interesting to do all the problems. I am um, looking forward to more, uh, sil- more uh, courses on substructure designs too. I am Dr. S. Uma Devi. Uh, working as an associate professor in uh, vit university chennai campus uh, i'm doing i'm doing the course of uh, nptel course of hardware modeling using uh, verilog so it's it is a eight week course uh, taken by uh, dr indranil sen gupta um, so each and every week uh, we i i was eagerly waiting for his videos uh, because it was perfectly matching with the course what we are currently taking so all his examples the assignment questions whatever uh, he is giving it will be interesting to solve as well as i can take those examples to set a hard questions to my students um and overall uh, i each and every nook and corner was covered and uh, 
it was challenging as well as interesting i mean i cannot say it's very difficult if we go through all the videos very properly as well as all the concepts whatever we he has covered uh, then we can face it uh, again the exam also was interesting so good evening to all i am maheshwari from satyabhama university nptel is a uh, very good for students and also the staff it uh, very useful to improve our career so i am in the teaching field so i um, i got some new methodology to solve the programming and uh, all the skills so it will uh, if the students uh, will use it means they can get more knowledge about uh, all side of the languages it, it may be the language uh, um, uh, that oh, what i want to say now um, not only the programming skill they can uh, develop their skills in variety of ways exam is uh, very um, <laughs> what time uh, because if uh, uh, attend the assignments and uh, submit the assignment properly na it will easy it is yeah so based on the assignments and because in the job, because in the, in in this time uh, the new editor they introduced in the java so it is very useful for the learners because uh, previous um, because it is uh, new for me so this time only i attend the nptel courses and the exams so uh, in java they provide a new editor so it uh, it it will improve the student skills program development skills so this time they good very good job in nptel java especially in the java but other uh, um, side i because in the programming language subjects and it's very superb if the program attend the subjects na it will easy to learn their knowledge so thank you thank you hello my name is dr mahalakshmi i am actually heading the department in uh, one of the uh, specialties in srm dental college <coughs> basically i have been uh, attending a few courses of mptel but this uh, this time only i actually wrote an exam also and i feel as uh, as a researcher uh, it actually helps me a lot in uh, you know honing my uh, um, specialty and also it helps in various ways in for the students as well as for researchers faculty members as well um it helps basically to um improve my uh, r- um, knowledge about any particular subject so this time i took up uh, uh, medical uh, bio nanotechnology so it was really very helpful for me hi yeah this is dr priya dashni i am assistant professor in uh, shri ramachandra medical college uh, today i had come to give uh, uh, the course exams for the course on uh, biomedical statistics the course was extremely useful and it helps us to understand in depth about the research process the exam today was also conducted in a very legible manner um we faced no difficulties after going through the course the exam was quite easy the assignments yeah was quite uh, um it was like a revision of all whatever lectures we had gone through the 23 courses the assignment questions had a brief uh, revision of all whatever concepts we have learned through the lectures uh, myself reka நான் வந்து இன்ஸ்டியூட் ஆஃப் கெமிக்கல் டெக்னாலஜியில் லெக்சராக ஒர்க் பண்ணுறேன் நான் வந்து என்பிடிஎல் கோர்சஸ் வந்து நிறைய பார்த்துருக்கேன் அதில் வந்து ஸ்பெஷல் ஸ்பெசிஃபிக்காக வந்து கெமிக்கல் ப்ராசஸ் சேஃப்டி கோர்ஸ் பற்றி ஃபஸ்ட் டைமாக வந்து ட்ரை பண்ணேன் கோர்ஸ் எக்ஸ்ப்ளனேஷன் ரொம்ப நல்லா இருந்துச்சு அதே போல் அசைன்மெண்ட்ஸ் வந்து டுவெல் அசைன்மெண்ட்ஸ் கொடுத்துருந்தாங்க டுவெல் அசைன்மெண்ட்ஸ் என்னால் ஒர்க் ப்ரெஷர்னால் கம்ப்ளீட் பண்ண முடியல நான் டென்த் தான் பண்ணேன் பட் டுவெல்லும் பண்ணியிருந்தா ரொம்ப நல்லா யூஸ்ஃபுல்லாக இருந்திருக்கும்னு ஃபீல் பண்ணேன் அதே போல் எக்ஸாம் வந்து டியூரேஷன் வந்து த்ரீ ஹவர்ஸ்ன்னு கொடுத்தது வந்து ஒரு ஒன் அண்ட் ஆஃப் ஹவர்ஸ் இருந்திருக்கலாம் ஏன்னா அந்தளவுக்கு கொஞ்சம் சிம்பிளாக தான் இருந்த மாதிரி இருந்தது ப்ளஸ் இந்த கோர்ஸ் வந்து எனக்கு எவ்வளோ யூஸ்ஃபுல்லாக இருக்குதுனா நான் டீச்சிங்கில் இருக்கிறதுனால ஸோ நான் கவர் பண்ணாத ஏரியாஸ் கூட இதில் வந்து அதிகமான சிலபஸ் வந்து அதிகமாக இருந்துச்சு கெமிக்கல் இன்ஜினியரிங் பொறுத்த வரைக்கும் சேஃப்டி வந்து ரொம்ப முக்கியம் அந்த ஆஸ்பெக்டில் தான் நான் அந்த கோர்ஸை வந்து சூஸ் பண்ணேன் ஏன்னா என்னோடய ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ்லாம் போயிட்டு இப்போ இண்டஸ்ட்ரியில் தான் ஒர்க் பண்ண போகிறாங்க அவங்களுக்கு ஃபஸ்ட்டு வந்து சேஃப்டி தான் அதுக்கப்புறம் தான் வந்து அவங்களோட ஒர்க் ஸோ அதை ப்ரிஃபரன்ஸாக வச்சு தான் இந்த கோர்ஸ் வந்து நான் எடுத்தேன் தேங்க்யூ மேம் டாக்டர் ஹெலன் ஃப்ரம் சத்யபாமா இன்ஸ்டிடியூட் ஆஃப் சயின்ஸ் அண்ட் டெக்னாலஜி சென்னை ஃப்ரீக்வெண்ட்லி ரைட்டிங் திஸ் எக்ஸாம் ஐ ஃபைண்ட் இட் வெரி ஈஸி யூஸ்ஃபுல் ஃபார் ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் டீச்சர்ஸ் அண்ட் ஐ எம் வெரி ஹாப்பி டு சி தட் ஈவன் இன் திஸ் கோவிட் சுச்சுவேஷன் many of the students were approaching 
which uh, that itself is showing that the importance of exam and the way they conduct i thank the organizers thank you myself prashna kumar thangavel uh, i am like doing my final years in triple ittm kanchipuram uh, i came to write this uh, python exam like uh, joy of computing in python the course was like very like it's it's a basic course where like everyone can learn about a python and it's it's very interesting to solve this like us questions even though due to this pandemic like everyone has been quarantined uh, like nptel has took some brave step to conduct this exams like i'm appreciating that but still like if uh, they are able to conduct in the like prote- uh, protected exam like in the room it's in my home it will be like best yeah assignments yeah assignments is like uh, quite good like because like every week uh, like wednesday is my submission during wednesday i thought like okay it's a uh, i have some work to do even though it's like it's based on that uh, course like what we what the teacher start to us in the videos yeah because like coding is the like thing basic necessary as i'm a mechanical engineer like coding is a basic step to like enter into one like it field uh yes myself uh, venkata shriram from rajalakshmi institute of technology actually uh, my college encourages me to do all those uh, nptel courses and uh, they are uh, very easy to understand and uh, it will it is making me to enrich my knowledge and it uh, it will be always useful for my future and uh, i like these uh, type of courses very much and uh, this is the second time i am attending uh, these courses and uh, really it is a great, great job and uh, the exam is in this pandemic it is very difficult to conduct all those exams but the team is doing the great job i i like the uh, thing uh, they are uh, doing this and uh, even this pandemic they are uh, conducting exams yeah assignments are entirely related to topic uh, if if we complete uh, every assignment uh, properly yeah, the exam is uh, literally easy but uh, i miss some of them so it, uh, the exam is a bit difficult thank you sir. so i am satyanarayanan i am a faculty in vit chennai uh, i have come here to take a deep learning se- uh, specialization exam so see, when i studied there was no deep learning in our syllabus uh later when i did my phd i used some of the topics uh, some of the concepts there but i want to read that as a course that was my long term plan and the nptel provided me the right platform and there is a assignment with fixed deadlines i prefer this type of mode uh, over the other mooc that is uh, given by coursera kind of thing so this is really beneficial and now i'm prepared to teach to my students the way the nptel instructor taught me so i learned a lot from here so it's more of a training for us of course the aict also accepts this as a fdp faculty development program so in a way it's multiple benefits uh, thank you i'm dr shruti from uh, srmc uh, associate professor in department of pediatrics and uh, uh, this uh, whole course has been uh, designed very uh, effectively and uh, it's very useful and the examination was uh, done uh, uh, very nicely it was conducted and it was like uh, a smooth process uh, it uh, was really helpful overall it was very f- useful doing the assignment and also they have given us the previous cycle assignment as well so which uh, really uh, empowered us in preparation for the exam thank you i am dr dhanlakshmi i am associate professor for the uh, actually uh, for the teacher profession i need to take this course first i felt when i took the exa- assignments and examination i thought the exams will be difficult but i felt it was good and the arrangements everything was good so many things which we were practicing while doing the research were wrong some of the points now i could uh, implement everything into my practice that's the thing thank you ah uh, see uh I would like to thank to the NPTEL group uh, such as a well organization uh, during this pandemic situation they had conduct the uh, that is online examination very well actually uh, frequently it's postponed but anyhow uh, he has conduct uh, they, uh, that group conducted successfully and then uh, we are did the examination very well so i'm um, uh, uh, what i uh, come to tell means uh, really uh, i thank and then um, it's a very appreciating thing uh, during this uh, pandemic situation Uh, I am Dr. Ratna. I am a faculty in a private in engineering institution. I regularly write NPTEL exam for the past four years. Actually, it is very uh, helpful for my career, and uh, they have made uh, excellent arrangement during the COVID time. Exam was easy. Assignments are uh, 
like um, tough only you cannot easily copy and paste you have to think and write only although like a 50 percentage of the assignment questions you can copy and paste you can search in google and you can find the answers but 50 percentage you have to think and do i am dr subita working as a assistant professor in madras medical college i am doing this course uh, did this course on uh, uh march and completed on june because of covid it was delayed and now uh, i have written the exam it is very interesting to write the exam mm, and it is also very competitive and it is very useful for me it's a, it's a very nice course and the assi- assignments also very good and the course materials also very very detailed detailedly explained and the all uh, teachers who have taken the t- class also it's very neat hi i am arun and i am working in fl smith and uh, currently i am working nearly for 4 years and i had an interest to uh, work on the subject which is conducted by nptel through swam and i was interested in design of reinforced concrete structures and uh, the course was explained pretty well in the nptel subject videos and uh, i think the exam is also pretty easy and uh, that's it the assignments given was a little bit challenging and uh, it was very much it was uh, making the subject more easier by um, clarifying the concepts i am uma mageshwari um, i am doing my pg course in mgr college by uh, through college only i am i started this course uh, in ptel course actually i am a new for uh, java so if for uh, according to me it's very useful clear explanation everything in the exam also uh, they are asking critical question uh, not uh, direct question most of the questions are uh, critical questions so it's very useful for me i am dr pravda i am a professor in the department of oral medicine and radiology satyabama dental college so i wanted to do this research bec- uh, this uh, course because i am doing my phd now so i thought it will be useful for me so to the course was very well uh, formulated the videos everything and i found it very useful i do prepare well but uh, the question was little tough <laughs> probably my preparation is not that enough but it was challenging and I really enjoy doing this course thank you i should thank icmr and the epidemiology department for organizing this assignments were uh, useful but after seeing the videos immediately we do the assignments so it was we find it u- easy but when we prepare it again probably we need some more time to do it thank you good afternoon my name is aneshkar uh, i'm currently studying uh, postgraduate at university of madras uh, i came here to write the nptel exam for dairy uh, dairy technology Uh, NPTEL is actually offering various kind of courses for uh, all uh, manners of fields for uh, many specialties i am i have currently written in this semester for cell culture technologies and dairy food technology uh, it's very useful for me and uh, in my upcoming endeavors like doing phd and other job related uh, aspects it's very useful for me assignments or uh, few assignments are a bit tricky and uh, i think they make us curious and uh, try to help us to work out that's what i think definitely anyone uh, i don't know about the other subjects in in ptl but uh, regarding the science related courses in ptl i think uh, swam is the best and this is the best uh, platform to develop our own skills yes. thank you i'm dr shubha uh, i'm professor of pediatrics in ramchandra medical college Um, I, i did the course uh, i mean to enhance my knowledge about this uh, program I, i mean the the course is uh, it's quite elaborate and i mean it takes a lot of time to go through the the videos and then answer the uh, assessment and uh, this one but i think uh, this course but i think uh, there should be a little more about some some basic knowledge about the this one like uh, since it's meant for most of the, for post graduates and uh, this one there should be some basic knowledge about what do they mean by like confidence interval 
what do they mean by uh, i mean some very basic knowledge has to be there i think that part i think they should focus a little more than more on the clinical trials exam was it was okay it was not i won't say very difficult because there were some questions you you are not very sure but uh, i mean definitely i think an average uh, this one you should be able to perform in this role. but my reason was that a uh, post graduate would I means compulsory for all the post graduates since they are very novice i think so, sometimes certain basic information has to be there in this Even course the basic level course also recommended for because they i mean they will not know anything okay. so i feel there should be a basic level course and then clinical trials can be maybe in advance because it may not be that much i mean though they must have some knowledge it may not be so much uh, relevant to a post graduate as much as and there should be more examples and working examples for you know the problems and uh, the sense of you so that you get to understand the subject better i am dr stalin from tirunamalai medical college the course is very useful uh, it is for my career improvement and for mca purpose uh, assignments are good it is uh, useful for future research purpose hello my name is ashwan I have taken up uh, Python and C courses on NPTEL. I have gone. I came to know about this course through my lecturers, and it will help me in becoming bright in my future. Thank you. My name is Siva Subramanian. I am an IT professional into AI and data science. Yeah, the NPTEL courses are very useful, particularly for person like me to develop the career. The videos are very well structured. content is very rich and assignments are well balanced and even the examinations are very good they will conduct a lot of planning and coordination has gone into the study material as well as the execution during the course as well as conducting the examination so many follow ups happened during this covid time when the jan to april exams are rescheduled and again many notifications sms messages emails to notify the exams are again being conducted again etc also they made a lot of effort to conduct the exams at home actually using a home proctored methodology a lot of experiments were and i attended twice actually so kudos to all the team who are behind these things actually the professors not only the professors but all other people who are involved against these logistics it's a very good opportunity for a citizen in india to pursue higher education with very minimal cost thank you i am a senior assistant professor in madras medical college in the department of dermatology so i am in government service in for the past 15 years it's a form of compulsory exam uh, usually uh, i am in dermatology we are not uh, interested in spm but i uh, went through a course in uh, gindi mj university for this one for uh, research uh, towards research publication it is very useful to write the exam sir actually i have revised thrice or four times with associate professors uh, uh, what to say we discussed a lot it was very useful i have a plan to come for that uh, what to say training program again and again once in a year in gindi so that i can improve myself in uh, research publication majority of questions are repeated from the assignments unless you go through it again and again you can't learn you can't apply unless you apply you have to mug it up it is not possible in our profession so you have to go it again and again though it is uh, somewhat irritating uh, good things will always taste bad so uh, we have to go through it's a good thing sir so that i can teach my pg students well thank you thank you this is sharda i'm working as an associate professor at srm institute of science and technology i work for the department of biotechnology I've, uh, this semester i'm taking i've taken three courses on nptel i have done one now i have one in the afternoon and one tomorrow i'm doing this as a part of my faculty development program but because it enhances my chances of transferring the information better to my students myself kavya i'm uh, doing a phd in vit university so i i have to do course study that is for sure uh, because i want to do research on deep learning so for that i have enrolled for this course and uh, it's a 60 lectures videos are present 
each are approximately for 30 minutes so this helped me a lot uh, throughout my research uh, research uh, in deep learning uh, in terms of medical field my name is h j surya i am from venkateshwara college and uh, apart from the curriculum this is a uh, course uh, that i am doing a course related to computer uh, architecture so i feel it will be very helpful to my uh, uh, resume the certification uh, good evening to uh, good evening to you all i am pushpa working as a professor in st peter's institute of higher education and research in the department of computer science and engineering i have come here uh, to uh, appear for nptel exam and uh, the course that i have done is uh, joy of computing using python uh, nptel is you no know, helping uh, both the students and the faculty in a very big way to improvise themselves okay in learning Uh, the trending topics in every engineering domain in that aspect this course has now helped me to augment my knowledge in the language python programming which will help me uh, to transfer my knowledge in a better way uh, to my students assignments are uh, really good okay for uh, joy of computing in python in particular it was uh, uh, the assignments uh, really has helped us to learn okay so we have to execute the code to learn and also this particular course has made the reading um, uh, learning uh, different by having a practical component attached with it wherein uh, it is it has been made mandatory uh, for the candidate to appear for the practical exam as well okay that has uh, no really helped us uh, to no uh, get our hands trained in python concepts thank you shila ravinda i am an associate professor in ramchandra university and uh, yeah i have got to know about this course recently during the lockdown period did the assignments regularly and it is very useful now before doing the course all these terminologies and statistics was <coughs> you know totally like greek and latin after doing the course after going through the videos and uh, reading through the assignments it was very very helpful and uh, i did the exam extremely well very confident now thank you so much my name is sundar i am a software person it's a very good course for anyone who is willing to learn the concepts were explained very clearly tough concepts they started from the basics and expanded it steadily to so, i mean even difficult uh, subjects were made to look uh, very approachable I'm mohammed abdul ka from tambaram I did my B.Tech in Crescent Engineering College. I have done this exam well, sir. So. Challenging and interesting, sir. This exam. Uh, hello, I'm Dr. Reni. Uh, I'm doing my M.D. from D.Y. Patel, Navi Mumbai. Uh, today's exam was good. Uh, the uh, because of the COVID, the care they had taken, uh, the precautions they have taken, it was really good. Uh, we actually expected the exam to be postponed a little bit, but uh, it was good. Uh, on our day to day basis we hadn't uh, uh, you know we didn't get much of a time to prepare it uh, but uh, the course the videos that they had provided was very useful uh, was very handy and uh, we have we, we were able to do it in the last minute and it is very it is a must that all the residents to, uh, should do it before uh, doing their thesis it was very helpful in that way the assignments were really the the 23 papers that we had taken online that was very uh, helpful uh, matlab because of that we were able to do the exam easily today